All right, praise the Lord Jesus who's given us everything we need today for our garlic marinated grilled striped bass. And here's the key to the garlic marinade. It's just garlic vinegar. A couple of months ago, I, you know, I just cleaned and peeled five full bulbs of garlic and put them in a jar with one quart of apple cider vinegar. And this vinegar has very powerful garlic flavor. Uh, so I use it in marinades and all my favorite dishes. So the garlic marinade is just one quarter cup of that vinegar and a full cup of water. And so a couple striped bass fillets, i just been in there overnight. I preheat the grill to high heat. I got a couple pieces of bacon warming up. Uh, they'll just mostly drip down the fat to keep, uh, keep a little smoke going in the grill for a little flavor. And so, uh, Go ahead, once the striped bass fillets are marinated, just put them right on the grill. There is a redeemer, Jesus, God's own son, precious lamb of God, Messiah, holy one. And you don't want to season with extra garlic because that's a lot of garlic flavor anyway. Uh, so if you use a, your favorite sp spice blend, uh, pick one that doesn't have much garlic in it. Uh, and then we're just going to hit it with the cayenne pepper. We'll turn it again uh, after that side's cooked. We'll go ahead and hit both sides with the cayenne pepper at the beginning. And then this bacon's moving a little slow in the drip down process. So I'm just going to increase the surface area of the bacon uh, to get it doing its work a little faster. Sometimes the bacon ends up to be edible. Uh, sometimes it cooks a little too much, but its real job is to drip down and get the smoke going. All right, it's been about two and a half minutes on that side. Go ahead and turn it over. Get a little more towards where the heat's coming from the bacon, bacon fat dripping down. All right, so it's been there on there a total of about six minutes by now. Let's go ahead, it's uh, looking real nice and done. All right, there's our garlic marinated grilled striped bass, looking great. All right, well that's cooling off of the taste test. Uh, some of my viewers are wondering, man, you eat all that fried food, how do you stay fit? Well, I do exercise a lot. I ride my bike about a hundred miles a month. I also, the key is moderation. The conviction I have from the Holy Spirit is that I can eat anything I want because all God, everything God created is good and is to be received with thanksgiving. However, I can't eat everything I want. So like in the fried food videos, we always have a moderate portion. Uh, yesterday I was making the, the fried striper video. So rather than fry up the whole pound of striped bass, which would be a lot for me to eat by myself, especially with the uh, artichoke hearts and the onion rings that I also made. I just saved half of the striped bass to grill uh, today for lunch. You notice I've got the big salad and I'm gonna measure out the salad dressing. I'm working on you know, reducing my fat calories by having, it's not fat-free salad dressing, it's good salad dressing but I just uh, use a measure to control the portion on the salad dressing. Oh, thank you, Jesus. All right, so let's try the... A swing and a drive! Mm. Deep left! Way wow. back! Gone! As good as it was last night fried, uh, this is better 
you got the grill flavor you got the garlic flavor the cayenne of course and using the bacon to drip down and make the smoke gives you a lot of bacon flavor but you don't have the fat or the salt from the bacon Hmm. oh thank you jesus take another look in the good good book don't let it pass you by let the holy spirit talk walk through the written word Jesus. Take another look in the good, good book. Don't let it pass you by. Let the Holy Spirit talk. Walk through the written word of oh, Jesus. Then you, you, you love Jesus. La 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 la. Then you, you, you love Jesus. La 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 la